All right, guys, I got a question about uh, your sandblasting setup. Um, I just have a, uh, one of these cheap ones from Harbor Freight. Uh, I got a little vacuum underneath there to kind of keep it clear when I'm blasting. Um, I'm having a hard time uh, getting nice flow. Um, the gun and everything, the hoses, everything is uh, all Harbor Freight. So I don't know if you guys are using the same thing. Um, but the thing tends to kink up and lose pressure and I don't think it's from the air compressor. I don't know if it's just a combination of horrible fittings. I'm not sure what the issue is, but I just wanted to kind of get an idea of what you guys might have set up. I've got like mixed media in here right now. I was running low on the white stuff that I got from Harbor Freight. Um, so I threw some, some, uh, uh, a black type that they had there that's, a lot more coarse I threw that in there and that didn't help <laughs> uh, the white stuff was definitely better um, but so that's basically what I have going on um, here's a line I don't know if maybe I'm using the wrong type of lines uh, this runs over here <laughs> not exactly nice but it, for the most part it works um, the main line goes outside to where I have the air compressor it just goes through that wall but, uh, so the air compressor has three lines, which I shut off the other two lines and I'm not using the one. One is for uh, just, you know, blowing, you know, cleaning things. The other one is for my cool mist, which I use for the grinder. <clears throat> um, I just have this little cheap, again, a little Harbor Freight uh, oil water separator there. Um, I, had, I have another one on the air compressor, which I'll show you in a minute. Um, but but I did have even I think a third one on there and I wasn't getting enough pressure because of it so I took that off and then the pressure increased so I have the the air compressor outside this little shed thing I built um so it's a 26 gallon air compressor central pneumatic and you know another Harbor Freight thing um there's the other oil water separator again, it's just a cheap one. Maybe if I'm going to some more expensive ones, it'll help with the flow. But I need to figure out something because it's taken me, especially now with the other media I put in there, it's taken me so long to sandblast even just, you know, one fixed blade, uh, one uh, folder. So <laughs> that's not going to work. I know, like I said, that when I put the black media in there, it made it a little bit worse. Well, decent, quite worse. But I just want to know what everyone else has set up so that I can kind of copy. And if, I'm sure you're going to see a lot of mistakes on here, things I should be doing differently. So I'll take any suggestions because I just got to do whatever it takes to get this fixed um, so that I can bust out, you know, knives a lot quicker. Um, so anyways, that's all set up. Sandblast cabinet there. The line's running here, going outside to the 26 gallon air compressor. So you guys got any ideas besides buying a much larger air compressor? Cause I think this is about as big as I can go and still use 110. And I don't want to mess with, you know, changing up the power supply or anything. Um, if you have any ideas, uh, let me know, please. Thank you.